This next video we're going to do is what we call a formal recall or formal com command. So this is going to make your dog coming to you when you practice this a lot more controlled and will make it easier to practice and also easier to add on distractions because it's great if your dog comes to you when there's nothing in between you, when you're in your living room and your dog's on the other side of the room, but when you really need this behavior is when for example, your dog gets off leash and there may be squirrels and leaves and other dogs in between you and your dog, you need your dog to come to you. So in future videos, we will show how to add on distractions, but right now we're going to teach how to make the behavior of your dog coming to you more controlled so you can practice it again in a more controlled setting. So what we're going to do to start out with is we're going to get our dog in a sit, we're going to tell our dog to stay. We're going to walk just about five feet away from our dog, call our dog to come. When our dog gets to us, we're going to ask them to sit, and that's the behavior that we're going to mark and reward. So for right now, we have already established a sit, we've already established a stay, we've already established come, and then we've already established sit again. So we're going to put all those things together and just reward at the very end. So let's give that a try. Hey, Darcy. Darcy, sit. Good girl. Darcy, stay. And if they lay down, that's fine. Darcy, come. Sit. Good girl. Great. Good girl. Let's try it again. Okay. Darcy, sit. Good girl. Stay. Darcy, come. Sit. Good girl. One more time. Great. So now Darcy's done a lot of training, so sometimes I'll say her name before the command, sometimes I won't. At this level, um, we've had her for eight years, and she's done eight years of training, essentially. Sometimes you can say it, sometimes you don't. If your dog seems a little distracted, you need them to get their, <clears throat> their attention back on you, you can say their name. So dog's name, sit, dog's name, stay. Otherwise, you can just do sit, stay, come, sit. All right, Jason, let's try again. Sit. Good girl. Stay. There she come. Sit. Good girl. Ah. So keep working that. You can move around your home. If you have a fenced-in secure yard, you can do it out there too so that your dog gets the routine of sit, stay, come, sit, and then the reward. This will also get them on a good routine of, of coming to you and having a little bit of self-restraint before charging at you before you've asked them to come.